You want to know something kind of funny is that I recently went to uh, the seminar of entrepreneurs, this and that, and they were wondering how many people read. And turns out that we entrepreneurs, we're like among the professions that read the least. Well, the top was like pilots and uh, uh, doctors, I think. But entrepreneurs were at the very bottom of the list, which is quite paradoxical because most of the issues that you and I face, someone probably already faced it. And because they were an entrepreneur, they probably were like, hey, let's write a book about it. Because that's what we keep doing. We keep starting new freaking businesses over and over. So yeah, they give me this book. It's a pretty good one. Read more. Hello, Shopify world. My name is Andrew from ecomexperts.io. And we're back with another Shopify review of video. So this week, we're looking at the announcement bar of Hextom. Hextom, if you are watching this, seriously, you guys, what is up? You guys keep pushing out apps at a speed. I mean, it's lightning fast. <laughs> Quick announcement bar. What do we know about it? It has a 4.9 out of 5 rating. Uh, it's about 1,000 reviews. 4,000 reviews. Hot damn. So there is a free plan and there is a plan that's about 10 freedom dollars every month. And beside that, I'm going to show you all the rest in this video. Now we're going to show you the competitors, the alternatives. Uh, we're going to show you the app, why it's fantastic, why it's not fantastic, however you want to interpret it. All right, let's go and check out the app. The app is installed, but first, as always, let's take a quick little moment to like and subscribe. It's really important. I know I keep asking this, but please subscribe if you like this content. So do it right now. All right, we are automatically redirected to the app dashboard. The dashboard looks simple, similar template that we had with the free shipping bar app by Hey, by the same developer, actually. Plans and pricing in the top navigation. Also, there is an FAQ. In case you need assistance from the customer support, well, then you need to do that from their website. So, unfortunately, no live chat or direct email, which is kind of a shame for an app that is this popular. But hey, maybe it's so fantastic, no one has any questions. Okay, back to work. Uh, it's time to create our first announcement bar. I'm thinking to create a bar with a 20% discount with the link to our collection. Click on this blue button that says create a new bar. Two new windows appeared, basic template and premium template. Premium templates look really beautiful actually, but the basic ones will do the trick because I'm cheap and we're don't have 500 subscribers yet, so subscribe. Basic templates are bold and clear, shades of gray, bright and elegant. Ooh. It's easy, harvest gold, good mood, trust me, fairy tale, and important things. We will go with it's easy. It looks clean enough for our team. I hope we will have the chance to customize it later since this emojis won't work with our particular announcement. Next stop is a preview. Uh, it looks pretty basic. Now we have a content configuration. The first field is the name of the campaign. Let's say fall winter sale. It's only for internal use so you don't have to brainstorm too much. Uh, the next step is a message. We will go with exclusive weekend sale. Get 20% off the entire order. The quick announcement bar app allows you to add a link to your bar. For example, you can add a button that will lead to a page dedicated to the promotional campaign or particular product on sale. You can add a button that will take you to the URL or you can make the entire bar clickable. Uh, we will go with a button since in my opinion, it will look nicer. Uh, for the button text, maybe we can write, get it now, all right? Our whole new collection is on sale, so we will add the URL of our catalog page. In this step, you can choose how the URL will be opened. We will check this option here that says, open the link in a new tab when clicked, and we don't want to include close button, so we will leave it as a no. Now we have a display position. We can choose between a wide, series of 
options as you can see right here. We will go with top bar pushes down, the rest of the page always visible while scrolling, so basically make it sticky, and jump to the style configuration. Background color is currently white, we will change it to some gray color, um, because that's the mood right now in Montreal, gray. Text color, uh, maybe blue, and special text is currently red, so we will leave it as is. And if you decide to use a paid plan, you can add your own background image image or choose from these beautiful templates. Also on a paid plan you can add animations to your bar buttons. Uh, plenty of funds are available so you really can customize this bar to fit your team which is really nice. Uh, we will choose 12 as the font size and the bar padding is actually okay. Uh, in this section here you can also set the rules for showing the announcement bar which is quite important. The last step is to set targeting configuration. We will display it on all pages and on all devices. Also, we won't exclude any pages because we're a very inclusive company. I'm just joking. Uh, if you decided to pay for this app, you can add the custom CSS or JavaScript. We will skip that because we don't pay for apps yet. And we click on save. The bar is created and we are back to the dashboard where we can edit, duplicate, or pause our active campaigns. All right, now it's time to see if this app is working so let's jump to our demo store and see the result damn there it is click on the button and yep working as promised all right this app is great in so many ways you can customize it to fit your team the bar really stands out on the website the free plan is pretty generous and the ability to make different rules just adds up to the overall greatness of the app. If you are running any sale or have something to announce, you should definitely try this app. Also for uninstalling, as far as we have figured out, you can simply uninstall it in the list of your apps in the back of your store and it does not look as if um, this app leaves a particular code inside of your store, meaning it wouldn't slow you down even if you uninstall it on the long run. All right, that is it for today, people. I hope you enjoyed this review. Did you hear about our Slack app? Our Slack app is free and posts Shopify news, industry news in bite-sized, just the title and the links in the in your Slack channel. So it's 100% free. You can just install it and you will get updates about uh, Shopify and what's happening. And often these updates can actually benefit your store. So you don't have to go check on Facebook and LinkedIn and yada, yada, yada. You can just do it through that. Anyway, make sure to check that out. Make sure to like and subscribe and check out our other videos about shipping bars and announcement bars and Hextom and all the other fun things. And make sure to read once in a while. You know, take a break, read a book. Mm, it smells nice, new books. Well, it's not new, but... Alright, cheers, guys! <laughs> <laughs>